This message is annoying, I know, but it's required by law in some countries, especially EU countries, but others as well. Uh, you have to inform and ask your users permission before tracking them with Google Analytics, with Pixel um, from Meta, with uh, TikTok tag, with anything. You need their permission. So, if you have a tiny message that is not visible, is not uh, uh, interrupting them in any way, it's easy to ignore. What happens? They browse your website. Maybe they close it by mistake somehow without saying yes or no. I want, I, I, I allow you to uh, track me or I don't want you to track me. And your tags will be blocked. You will not be able to track a user that ignores such a message. So for um, countries that require user permission before tracking, the constant prompt should be big and block everything else until i mean i cannot scroll you see I, I'm, I'm trying to scroll but i can't until the user says yes allow or or more actions and they configure i don't know like this categories according to their wish and then the website becomes available uh, i said no to youtube scripts so i cannot view the youtube video from here but i can change this easily and now i can view the youtube video if you use pixel your site and constant magic actually pixel your site is not required if you use constant magic our uh, constant plugin all this is very very easy to configure because we have various rules targeting different regions and uh, this one targets country from gdpr um, region so EU countries we can configure this here and um, we have a constant type called ask before tracking that does exactly what I told you previously uh, informs and ask, ask permission before tracking is enabled there are other constant types that you can configure just inform no tracking is blocked or inform and opt out we have those for other rules targeting other regions so they can behave in a different way uh, but for this particular constant type we recommend to use a large pop-up or a bar to block scroll until uh, interaction with the constant prompt is completed and uh, to hide the close button because you don't want uh, your users to close the message without saying yes, I allow you to track me or no, I don't want you to track me. So these are the recommended settings for um, ask before tracking constant type where tracking is blocked. For other rules, you can have different options. Uh, for example, rest of the world, uh, which is a rule that tracks um, countries that have no requirements. Uh, regard of um, consent and tracking you can uh, have a small message you, you should not block anything let me show you you can close on scroll if you want so if i scroll the page that rule will disappear uh, so it's it's easier and simpler and for rules where you can start tracking before consent is expressed some countries um, have such regulations and it's a constant call inform and opt out so tracking works but they they can you a user can say okay i i don't want you to track me for uh, marketing reasons it is doable well for for such rules you can um use again a different kind of uh, configuration with a small um, pop-up or bar and uh maybe you can enable a close button i mean in this case it's not hidden away so the close button is visible on that pop-up um, so adapt your rule to the requirements of each country and never never use a small constant prompt for uh, regions that 
require uh, user acceptance before they can be tracked. That's it. Um, Christian Stoichescu from Pixel site and Consent Magic. Consent Magic is our Consent plugin. It has support for Google Consent uh, V2. So Google Consent Mode V2. If Google Tags are installed with Pixel Your site, it does a lot of things, including geo-targeted rules, and uh, it's very easy to use, and I highly recommend it. Thank you for watching. Like this video and subscribe to our channel.